What is up and welcome to Maps on the Map. In this series of videos, we're gonna be exploring Copenhagen, Denmark, a place that's been on my travel list for a while. Copenhagen has earned its spot as one of the foodie capitals of the world, famous for Danish pastries, hot dogs, smorbord, and it's also home to 2021's best restaurant in the world, Noma. In the next few videos, we'll be showing you some incredible bites to eat and the top things to do in Copenhagen. But in this video, I'm gonna be showing you where we stayed, now when I go on a city break, since most of my time will be spent exploring and munching, what's important to me in a hotel is location, cleanliness and something that isn't going to break the bank and the Wake Up Copenhagen Hotel smashed all of that. So let's check out the room. What is up and welcome to Maps on the Map and welcome to Copenhagen, the Wake Up Hotel. Corsten Nibrisgaard. I don't know if I pronounced that right, but come on in, let me show you this. That's wrong, it's, it's Wake Up Copenhagen. <laughs> what is up and welcome to Maps on the Map, and today we're at the Wake Up Copenhagen Hotel, Corsten Nibrisgaard. <laughs> you said like Copenhagen completely wrong. Wake Up Copenhagen? You said like, you said it wrong. Okay, do it again. What is up and welcome to Maps on the Map, and Wake Up Well. <laughs> <laughs> What is up and welcome to Maps on the Map and welcome to Wake Up Copenhagen, Karsten Niebersgaard. I have no idea if I pronounced that right, but we move. Come on in and I'll show you the room. Now I'm functioning on basically no sleep. I don't think I've slept for like 36 hours. So if I'm a bit rusty, not my fault. So we have a really nice spacious room. Looks a bit like a spaceship. This is the wardrobe, as you can see, coming with four hangers to hang your stuff. And here, in the spaceship-esque... I fell over! <laughs> ...camera radius tripped over. So here, if you want to come on in, is the bathroom. It's actually not bad. It's not like the smallest bathroom, but it's not the biggest bathroom. You got your sink. You got a nice wake-up Copenhagen cup. Hand wash, towels, hair dryer a toilet, what more do you need? And then you've got this kind of teleporting shower pod which looks a bit like a water slide that will drop you down. <laughs> With these weird doors, but this is fun. So yeah, a nice kind of small shower, but not bad. There actually isn't much to show you about this room because we've almost finished the tour. But follow me and we've got the living quarters. You can chill here, have your dinner, Watch your TV. We've got a nice LG TV with a nice remote there. And then look at this hipster bin. Uh, never seen a bin quite like this. We've got this nice plastic bag and a bit of aluminium folded to add to the spaceship vibes. And if you follow me, we've got the suitcase area. Not the tidiest area, but that's all right. And you've got this door, which I think connects to the other person's room, but it's locked. I <laughs> mean, I think I'm moving the handle. And then you've got this decent sized bed actually. It's got one pillow, but in this drawer down here, we have discovered another wake up cup. Nice merchandise there, extra pillows and towels. And the bed is pretty big. And that's about it for this room really. But I save the best till last. We've got some mad Copenhagen views. So follow me. Look at this, mm -mm, delicious views, nice brick wall and some trees and a car park. So that is good, good Copenhagen vibes right there. But when you're on a city break, we don't need to stay in the fanciest of hotels because we're not really in the room. Now this hotel was cheap and it's bank holiday weekend, it's Easter weekend and it's about £50 per night. Slap bang in the center of Copenhagen. It's about a five to 10 minute walk from most things. So Tivoli Gardens and Tivoli Food Market, it's about, I'd say 10 minutes, 10 minute walk. So location wise, smashed it. Price wise, cheapest chips. So when you're on a city break, I can't complain with this hotel. It's clean, people are nice here, the lobby's nice. So that concludes today's room tour. Wake up Copenhagen, Karsten Niebrisgaard. And if you enjoyed this video and you have any more questions about this hotel or Copenhagen, then you can leave a comment and I'll reply or DM me on Instagram. And don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe to the channel. As always, it's been a pleasure. Till next time, peace.